Hey guys, what's up? It's Nuclear Videos HD, and I'm here with the latest update for The Simpsons Tapped Out. Today we're here in Act 1, Part 2 of the Christmas Update 2017, where in the previous video we went through and pretty much just began the update and got most of the tutorial stuff out of the way. So in today's video, we're going to pretty much just continue off from that point and hopefully complete the Act 1 quest line. Now, if you guys haven't seen the previous video, which I highly recommend you watch, um, you will know that we are in no way, shape, or form even close to being done with this uh, act for the update. There's so much stuff still to cover, and we're pretty much just discovering new things as we're going here. So, still a lot more stuff to go. I mean, we're probably going to have at least three or four uh, videos for Act 1, maybe even five, plus a lot more other stuff we need to cover. So, there's a lot of content here to go over. So, without further ado, let's get to it. want to get through this as fast as we can. So we're going to continue off here with the uh, quest line here with Lisa. Looks like the regifting machine is arousing scientific success with the prize, nominations, and the university tenure. That's great. Now, if we can just find something else for Lisa to worry about. We have to help the other Springfields. Robofunzels have started taking over their towns, too. And there you have it. Okay, so, as they usually do in all these kind of updates, we have to go and visit a neighbor Springfield and tap on their enemies. So we're over here in other Springfield. Okay, there's one, there's another, and come on, one more, there we go. So that's that. And it's also worth noting that they also added a uh, enemy location button, I guess we'll call it that, but I'll show you what I'm talking about in a minute. So, this will load up, here we go. So if you look over in the top right corner of the screen, you'll see uh, this little icon here. Pretty much what that does is that just brings you to a tappable enemy, which is a really cool feature that they added. <clears throat> Saves us obviously a lot of time having to go and search for these guys, which is really good. So I'm glad that they added that. So we're going to continue off here with the quest line. Hey everybody! We did it, the RoboFunzos are thinning out. I can't believe we managed to wrap everything up in one act, usually it takes three. Well, now that you've said that, I did notice a suspicious, suspicious new construction site. What's so suspicious? The sign on the construction fence says, Coming soon, new brick and mortar bookstore. Alien invasion site or bookstore, they're both equally terrible. Make Bart hate reading, make Lisa regret saving Bart, make Santa gang discover Funzo, Robo Funzo bodies, and place the Rigelian construction site. Okay. So we'll send Bart to go and hate Bart? reading. Yes. We'll send Lisa to go hey, and hate everybody. Bart. Send these guys to go and do that. Wow. We'll send uh, Santa Kang to discover Robo Funzo oh, bodies. Oh, oh. He's not going to be happy about that. Kneel before your alien and master. now we have to place the Rigelian construction site. Okay, so that's the sixth prize, which we need to uh, wait a little bit to unlock. So, not really sure where I want to go from here, because I don't want to spoil this and go through and rush through the prizes just to complete that. So I'm going to see what else we have to do here. <clears throat> we might actually have to do that right now, because it doesn't seem like any other quest lines or anything are prompting here. Um, I know we have the regifting machine, which uh, has its own set of prizes and stuff. I'm not sure yet if I'm going to show that in a whole different video or what. I feel like there's so much more that has to pop up, you know what I mean? Um, hmm. So maybe we need to get that prize first. So I guess we'll do that. Why not? So we'll go through, I guess, and uh, get the prizes now. So the next prize we get is the Rigelian Christmas Toy Workshop. We'll get that. And place it down. Oh wow, this thing is small. Wow, that's like probably one of the smallest buildings that we have. I was expecting it to be a lot bigger. But, uh, okay, so it has uh, a clock and a little sign that has a question mark. Days till Christmas, they don't even know when it is. And we have some of those Robo Funzos crammed in the side of the building. So the building sound for this is some uh, laser sounds and some hammering. Uh, luring humans with toys is the building task and earns 300 cash and 30 XP every day. So that's a pretty crappy payout, but 
whatever. So let's see, Kang has some dialogue with this. Oh, oh, oh! Hooray, Kodos. Now we have our own version of the OSHA violating toy workshop. Hurry, have them craft some cheap plastic toys that I'll get tired of in two minutes, throw away, and then pollute the oceans with. Ha 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 ha, ha ha ha. Make Kang make cheap toys. Oh, oh, I'll just oh. chill out in my glass dome. Okay, so we're going to go and send him to do that. And the building animation for this is uh, chimneys and stuff start smoking, and uh, the clock is going haywire. I'm getting athlete's tentacles, so, something terrible. That. So next prize we have is the free land token. Okay, get that. Next is the ice skating rink. Place that down over here. Pretty neat. So when you click on that, a couple ice skaters come out and skate around. And uh, uh, I guess I guess that's always I guess that's a constant running animation rather than one that you. Oh, I guess okay. Never mind. I guess it's one that you have to click on. But anyway, that's the animation for it. Ooh, it's one of those perilous oblongs of ice that the humans enjoy breaking tailbones on. Let's go skating. With eight tentacles, you skate. the skate rental will kill you. I don't want to go on the ice. I merely want to hold eight cups of cocoa. You know, sometimes I regret bringing you to Earth. Make Kodos hang out at the ice rink. Okay, so we'll send them to go there. Okay, there's that animation again. Building sound for this is uh, some people skating and selling hot chocolate is the building task earns 200 cash and 20 XP every 12 hours which is nearly as much money as the toy workshop makes in a whole day but uh, we won't talk about that the next prize we have is the worker elves who I'm not sure if they're separate characters or one but I'm going to venture to say that they're just one hey hey yeah. you does anyone know who that is so their unlock message is work hard, party harder, the worker elves. They go into our winter 2017 category, and they have some uh, quests over here. Oh great, so glad we are in this miserable little town instead of the North Pole. Does this count as overtime? Because I've already put in way more than my time this season. Nobody's like you don't get overtime. Brace your elf, Christmas is coming. You just lowered my elf esteem. Oh god. So they probably have their own quest line, which we won't waste our time going through. They don't have any voice, sadly. But they can toil long hours for four hours, hide from Santa for 60 minutes, happily make toys for four, take a munch needed break for eight hours, clean reindeer stables for 12 hours, and drink too much eggnog for 24. So, okay. So that's the little elves there. They kind of just are going to chill over there for now. I'm really actually disappointed that they never gave us the happy little elves as characters. Um, because I remember they were in one of the Christmas events, and I was hoping that we were going to get them, but we never did. Anywho, now let's place down the Rigelian construction site and continue off this quest line. So place that down. And it's weird. This is basically just the same exact building or decoration or whatever you call it. The... The laser that we already have over here so not sure why we're building another one but nevertheless we'll do it anyway so that's where buildings come from my beautiful toys all destroyed i was just trying to bring a little joy to the planet i plan to subjugate stop moping this holiday is saturine enough as it is the act one story is done keep expanding your north pole and destroying robo funzos act two starts soon okay so that's that, and when you click on their little construction site. So that's the building sound. As of right now, it doesn't do anything when you click on it. But uh, subjugating puny humans for laser, laser creation is the building task, and it earns 200 cash and 20 XP every 12 hours, similarly to the ice rink. So that's that. Uh, we have some quest line here for Kodos or Kang. Ho, ho, ho. Erg. Why do I have to imitate this Kris Kringle creature for us to invade Christmas? When we were invading Halloween, I didn't have to pretend to be some kind of holiday-appropriate monster like the Great Pumpkin. That's because you were the holiday-appropriate monster. Couldn't I pretend to be the Grumple? That feels truer to me. 
Sorry, they used him up in a previous update. Make Santa Kang be torn over Halloween or Christmas. Oh, I'll just chill out in my glass dome. Okay, so we'll send him to do that. I'm getting athlete's tentacle, something terrible. Okay, I'm dressed up as this cheery fatso Santa, now what do I do? Well, you decide if children are naughty, if so, you give them a lump of coal. Excellent, coal, devastating, I'll get right to work. Inappropriate, regulations state you must label most kids nice. It's like the American college system, everyone gets at least a B. Make Santa Kang reluctantly label kids nice. Oh, kind of slay! Hey, I work hard for that B. <laughs> Giving masters. presents to everyone who is exactly what's wrong with today's permissive slave societies. Okay. Kang, to properly imitate Santa, you must be prepared to participate in the ritual of the mall photo opportunity. Pretend I am a human child and I have just emitted a large amount of liquid protein strands onto your lap. What do you do? Devour your head and send your parents to the grit mines of Deneb 5. 6. Incorrect. You say, what a cutie, and smile for the camera. Kodos, it is unseemingly to throw bull pucky at a fellow Rigelian. What? Make Kang wonder how he got himself into this. Oh, oh, I'll just oh, chill out in my glass dome. Oop. I don't know how I clicked on that. So we'll send Kodos, or sorry, Kang to do that. Hail before your alien masters. Oh, oh, okay, I will put up with all this Santa nonsense for the glory of our conquest. Is there anything else? Yes. On Christmas Eve, you drop down the chimney. Drop what down the chimney? Cobalt, thorium, grenades, a nightmare lizard from Arcturus 9. Yourself in a bag of toys. You know, if people see me doing that, it's going to get a little tough to persuade them I'm an overlord. Make Santa Kang practice going down oh, chimneys. Time to slay! Okay. I'm getting athletes. Kodos, I'm stuck in the chimney terrible. again. Do not post pictures to social media. Oh, oh, so once I'm oh. down the chimney, what next? Leave the presents, eat the pets. This time you're wrong. I eat the cookies. My transformation into Santa is complete. Ha ha ha. Ho ho ho, dear. Right, right. Sounds weird, but okay. Make Santa Kang assimilate into winter holiday. Oh, oh, I'll just chill oh. out in my glass dome. So he's ready to be Santa. I'm getting athlete's tentacle, something terrible. And that's that. So I guess that's it for the uh, Act 1 quest line. I wasn't sure why I went through that quest line. I thought it was kind of important, but I guess not. So uh, before we end this video, I will just go through and get the final prize, which is... The Mrs. Kodos Claws Bundle. So we'll get that real quick and place it down. Hey, hey, you! Does anyone know who that is? So, Mrs. Kodos Claws. I just can't stop at one elf. So she goes into our Winter 2017 category. And this is a building, too? Oh, my God. This is... Okay, check it. This is probably the smallest building. Well, one of the smallest buildings. Heads up! So that's where buildings come from. Okay. So when you click on this, the Rigelian Christmas fireplace, the building sound is this weird tech techie sound. Stuffing stockings with terror is the building task and earns 300 cash and 30 XP every 24 hours. Pretty cute little fireplace. Okay, we'll click on Kodos Kill, here. Destroy. Our invasion will only triumph if we fool the humans into thinking we are Santa and his wife. Must I really wear this disguise? The dress is uncomfortable and does not flatter my ovipositor. What is there to flatter? <laughs> Joking, please, Kodos. Put away the laser blaster. Relax, I'm going to use it to bake some cookies. And then your gluteoids. Okay. So this is probably an unimportant quest line, which we're definitely not going to waste our time going through. But uh, we could check out what tasks Kodos has. She can bake Christmas cookies for four hours, spike hot cocoa with Rigelian whiskey for 60 minutes, keep the elves in line for eight, celebrate human holidays for 12, and hang the mistletoe for 24. So that is her set of tasks there. And I keep calling her a her. I'm like pretty sure that's a girl. I'm not 100% sure with that. But it uh, seems like that's it for Act 1, the quest line portion of it, and the prize track at least. So we will, of course be back with the Act 2 prizes and stuff later on. We still have to go through and show off the regifting machine, the uh, Jesus Carpentry Shop, the items available in the store, and the uh, holiday scratchers. So we're going to stop the video here, continue off in Part 3 of the Act 1 video line here. Um, I'll be uploading this right now, and of course as soon as this is done, I will try to upload 
the next video. So stay tuned for that. And until then, I will see you guys later. Keep on tapping and peace out. Mm -hmm.